uh, 3D printing is uh, basically a computer 3D model that's designed by a software program. What it does, it actually prints using a plastic material, in this case, layer by layer. Generally builds from one layer to another until the completed object is then completed. This all began by mistake. Um, so we started doing this initially, we were given the 3D printers a few years ago actually and we didn't know really what to do with them. We thought they were going to change the world, print spaceships, do all this magic on their own and they didn't. So we packaged them away um, and then through going through online and Google we came across Enable. Enable is a global network of 3D printers and specialists and software engineers who've come together to create the program and print the prosthetics. So NASA really is part of a bigger community and we're just bringing that part of it into Zimbabwe. So now we are in the workshop and this is where the 3D printing happens. So we'll take you through the process now. All our 3D prints begin with design. So this is how we do it. With the hands, most of them are already designed. So all we do is customize them using a 3D customizing software. So the software we're using right now is called Materialize. It's compatible with our Leapfrog 3D printers, which are some of the best in the market. The next step is now uh, to, to take the file, to take the file to, to the printer. We put it on a USB stick like this. Uh, then we start to, to, to print. The printer has to heat up to a certain degrees so that it will hit that filament uh, to form to, to, to try to print in uh, successive layers. So the process can take hours, even days. As you can see, right now we're just printing just the fingers and it has taken us 2 hours 57 minutes just to print 51%. When printing the arm, we don't print it at one go. We print it piece by piece, then we join them together. So the last part is the final touches. So that's the smoothening, the smoother the product, we remove unwanted material that might have stuck to the product and just make sure that it's in good movement before we send it for quality control. When we look at 3D printing, it gives us the opportunity to print it, basically anything that maybe we can rather than import, we can manufacture. And I think that's where we want to lead to with this. I think the world needs more of good and, and, and love in our homeland. And so we're just trying to encourage that really. Um, it's not that expensive in comparison to your normal biotic, bionic um, prosthetics, which range anywhere from twenty to two hundred thousand dollars. These prints, at the moment, cost us approximately two to three hundred dollars. And for a company, that's that's not a lot, but for an individual, that's it's a life-changing prosthetic that we're able to give them and help with. So the the one that we did do um, to Hard Life, who's Caps United Pair. When he first drank using his prosthetic, and he spilled water over himself actually, him and I packed out laughing and he was like, I'll do this, I'll get this. I was, it's overwhelming, you know, because for us it's work, we're printing and we're just writing prints and we, we're doing what we're supposed to do in our nine to five. But when you see what the implication is of the print and what it actually brings someone, all of a sudden it's not work. It's, it's something entirely different. Yeah, these are some of the examples of the stuff that we've you know, originally printed you know, in the beginning stages. I mean, this is part of the globe that we've begun printing, as you can see. Someone took an interest and took the other half of it, but these are some of the, the interesting things that we've started off with. And this is another one, which is the Eiffel Tower, which uh, resembles the Eiffel Tower as much detail as possible. You know, if you had to take a closer look at it, you can see the actual construction of it uh, from inside and out. And you know th these are the possibilities you know, that we can do with printing with anything. Can't go move our own life. My nephew, I'm going to do the board. The board is ready. And I can see over Facebook, which I know on my pictures. I get them. Oh no, it's in the far away. Go on it. It's artificial. I get up on Facebook. I can go to the national campaign. I can go on it. It's ready. Go on it. Go on it. Then. 
the this locus in your but like a portrait drink. So the banana ones of far and the can you con connect me to that guys so that I can come and do my wait to ask then then. Let me move on with my hand, with my one hand. It's okay with me. The far as wrong because when that tomb was taken, that tomb feel a good thing. Rock or wrong, right? I say, what's okay? Yeah, that tomb feel a good thing. That one is rock. So as far as we reach it, go bad, but I know it's such a Message and don't want to reserve it to the right, and it's good for you guys to come. Mom was a moment, but quite it's fine.